peace everyone um, I noticed like um, a few weeks ago they started to say that um, non-white people were hit harder by COVID-19 the UK study suggests okay so that was on the 7th of April and now um, just two days ago they're saying virus cases to be tracked by ethnicity amid rising BAME deaths for all those who don't know it says here black Asian and minority ethnic backgrounds okay so look a bit bigger look at the bigger picture all this causes a bit of racial tension for people who are a bit now reminded and um, uh, believe in everything thinking that people can spread this and kill one another are they going to say that these people have got more chance of having it and therefore going to have tension against them will this bring the far right more into play again because they wanted rid of Im immigrants anyway this is a perfect chance to do so um, remember though if the immigrants go a lot of jobs that um, n uh, natural born people here will do they won't do and then that will uh, cause the economy to collapse even more than it's going to anyway um, but yeah I don't want to live in a world where there's racial tension even more than there is now uh, you can see it happening in China where um, African people getting um, smacked up by Chinese people blaming them for this coronavirus yeah um, and the same in um, for example in India they were um, spraying bleach over immigrants as well um, bleach yeah so it's a pretty scary world we're living in right now and it looks like they're trying to divide us again they tried a war against Islam, war against drugs Brexit, transgender agenda, all this type of stuff trying to divide people and make, it, make each other hate one another uh, whereas um, we need to be hating the elite who are putting us against each other and who are benefiting from it Okay, so to see what they're doing for what it is, look at the bigger picture. Do they want to start race wars? It's a big possibility. It's already happening in China. People are getting persecuted. Okay, take care. Peace.